Hello friends, we back for another JoJo reaction. Today we're checking out part 6, episode 23. You now in the last episode we got The Death of FF, our best girl. Okay, that really hit me hard. That really hit me hard. It's probably... It might be the hardest death we've had, right? Like, aside from, like, the main characters, like, uh, you know, the the whole Joseph, you know, uh, Jonathan. So when we got, like, those deaths, it, it was sad, you know, Caesar, you know. I, I, I think I like, I like FF more than uh, Caesar. Yeah. When I when I look at the parts, Abacchio, Narancia, you know, like all these characters, really, FF really hit me the worst. So we're gonna get the fallout of what happened there. It looks like Jolene, Jolene survived. Um, Anastasia barely survived, and FF fell. So we still have Hermes. In, I guess, in recovery, we have a weather report somewhere in the cell. And uh, who's this? Our best boy. Emporio! Somewhere in the cell. So we're going to get the fallout this episode. Uh, without further ado, let's check it out. Ooh. We get some Emporio. Really like a nightmare. They've issued a maximum class security alert. Everyone here is armed to the teeth. He's already left the Green Dolphin Street prison for who knows what. Oh. He didn't have any belongings. And I confirmed that he wasn't carrying a baby anywhere on him. I've been so bored I gave myself a belly ring. <laughs> anyway, did you bring the disc with you? Emporio, do you have it now? Did you contact the Speedwagon Foundation? No way I could with such tight security. But of course I have the disc, Jolene. Okay. I would never leave it lying around somewhere. But at the moment, you're the only person they can question about it. And this area is the most heavily guarded. Are you saying you want to escape to my room? I don't think you get it, Emporio. I'm hmm. talking about the prison. I'm breaking out of this place. Oh. I can't sit around here and wait anymore. It's time. I'm getting off of Green Dolphin Island. You'll show me the shortcut. I, I'll definitely call the Speedwagon Foundation for you, Jolene. And now that I've finally read my father's memories, I know what the last 20 years mean. Also, I understand why my father decided to seal away Dio's stand ability. Dio! That is, my old man would never let that priest get away. My name is Jolene Cook. Oh my god, that's the post from the opening. Just obtained. The Emporio, Hell yeah. Do you honestly plan to stay here forever? But what about after that? There's no one else here who can help you right now. It's only me. Hermes and Anastasia are still in the medical ward recovering, and yep. they'll be there a while. Weather is secluding himself in his cell for some reason and won't even come to my room. I have that Dude, weather is so weird. <laughs> so unreliable. Impossible! Nobody has been able to escape this prison, not ever! There were inmates who were punished severely for even contemplating breaking out! I would hate for us to lose the disc, it took so much time and trouble to get back! North 28 degrees 24 minutes. West 80 degrees 36 minutes. Where is that? Mm. I, I'm sorry, Jolene. I want to help you, but I can't. Oh my god, imagine if Emporio was a double agent. That would be insane, right? If he was working for Pucci all along. Oh. We got a stand user. Menacing. Well, you've got guts, that's for sure. You came right out and showed me your face and stand. Want to tell me your name? I'm Mew Mew. And you can call my stand Jailhouse Lock. I'm sorry. Jailhouse a Lock. Tickets. Jailhouse Lock. What what could that be? 
I have no idea. Uh, no singing today, guys. <laughs> I have no idea. This is Aura. Aura. It's inside the bars. I'm warning you again, Jolene Kujo. So oh. I know you hear me. Don't touch the iron bars. The more you think about escaping, the closer you'll get to a very ugly death. Is this your ability? Take this! Huh? What? You want me to call someone for you? Yo, this is freaky. What the hell happened What's there? What's up, Jolene? Two, know that you can only retain up to three new things at a time. Three, defeat the stand user. Her name is Mew Mew. Oh shit. What's all this? And who wrote it? Did they use this pen to write it all down on me while I was sleeping? Go see him for I remember now. I was in solitary because of the security incident. I pierced my belly button. And then? And... And after I said I was escaping... Right, somebody showed up. But who? <laughs> What the? I wrote all these. This is my handwriting. Oh, wow. And I have no memory of this. Dude, it hey, fucks you. with your memory. I'm suddenly back here at the female ward. You can only remember three things. Hey, answer the question. Dude, this what the is hell sick. are you ignoring me? I've been asleep till now, so I honestly don't know. Uh, uh. All right, listen up. I swear I'm not joking when I ask this. Do you think... I could have written these words by myself, on my own body without help. Mm -hmm. <sighs> oh, wow. Uh, uh, yeah. By any chance, Gwes, have I been asking you the same few questions? Oh my god, that's right! Dude, imagine that. Because you can only retain three things. I guess this is like within the short term, right? Like within a few days. Like you still have long term memory. Otherwise, you wouldn't you wouldn't recognize why you're in the jail, right? Damn. I love this ability because I I, I love like psychological shit. But damn, you ask Gwes these questions, and as soon as you retain new information you immediately forget that you asked her these questions and you're in the same boat. Like three things, it's not enough. You need, you need more, right? You need to be able to retain more to like figure it out. Amnesia brought on by a traumatic shock you received while you were in the hole. It's affected your short-term recall severely enough that you can only memorize up to three things at a time. You Damn. can still remember events in your past, but if you manage to memorize a fourth thing, you will forget another one. For real? Damn, it's been, been two back days. Here for two days? Yeah, and I hope you feel better soon. You'll need it. Two days? I was asking the same questions for two damn days. Yeah. But why would I uh, defeat the stand user? Her name is Mew Mew. Mew Mew. <gasps> oh no! There's more of this shit! What is all this? Incidentally, Gwes, you know someone who goes by the name Mew Mew? Looky there, Jolene, you can ask new questions. Yeah, she's from the floor above. Oh. If I'm right, she's a bleach blonde bad split ends. About your height, I'd say. I don't know what shit she pulled to get locked up, but I bet it was major. At any rate, the woman's trash. God. <laughs> Coming from Gwes? Go find her now? <laughs> that must if be you legit. Looking, you would have seen her. She just walked past the door a second ago. <laughs> Where's cut out stockings? <laughs> Wait, I'm back here? Oh my god, you already forgot. <laughs> Who is Mew Mew? Is she? There a problem, hon? Uh, no. You said you were gonna go eat just now. It's almost time for lunch. Good timing. Oh, is that so? Oh my god, yeah. Dude, this is Don't some Shutter Island shit. Jolene Cujo. I don't care what your plan is. You and your friends will never be able to get past Jailhouse Lock or me. And? <laughs> then they're gone, huh?
drink up. You've earned it. Ah. Uh, rest in peace, FF. Damn. I, I, hey, I wanna see Ermis back, bro. Meal ticket now! What are you talking about? I'm here to get some lunch. Then you better show me your lunch ticket. You're walking out what? of here hungry if you try to pull any shit. Hurry up, show me. Don't have all day. Why don't you just step aside? Bye. Get out of here. Next. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh my what god. Was I doing just now? I the problem I is, the more things you write was... down, the more things you're gonna confuse on which to prioritize. It had to be at least important enough to take the trouble. Julene! That's my lunch you're eating! Drop that fork now! Oh. oh man, it's almost gone! That was my favorite cheese penne and you snarked it all! Dumbass! You put your own meal ticket in your pocket this morning! Uh, and maybe you should write it down somewhere this time. I gave my meal ticket to Gwes, I didn't lose it. My bad. Mm. Yep. Another unnecessary information. Who's this? A user? That can only mean that it's a stand. Oh, that's right. I have to go find Emporio. Yeah. I was trying to escape from the isolated cell. And I was probably with Emporio at the time. That's the only explanation. How about a new one? <sighs> this again? Do they serve the same crap every day here? Damn, how many how how long Not has it been? Hungry. I'll just eat has it been like a week already? Hey Jolene, huh? mind if I sit down? Oh no. <sighs> Tall blonde. Split ends. Cut out stockings. <sighs> you asshole! The hell are you doing to my lunch? This needs some mustard. Maybe a little ketchup too? <laughs> oh my god, she's gonna forget! This thing would be the perfect touch. Oh wow, yeah, she... yeah. That's that's three. <laughs> she, she already forgot. Oh wow, this is delicious. She is a mental so patient, on. guys. Oh no, I'm so sorry, Jolene. Look what a mess I've made. Please let me clean it up. Oh, it got all over your oh, arms. Oh no, you know, she's really dirty. I'm just gonna the wipe clues. away all that grunge. Scrubby scrub. Eventually, it'll even drain your will to escape. It might feel something like paralysis, but really, that's your appropriate punishment for trying to break out of prison. But why is she helping Pucci? Something, but what? What's important? What's something I cannot forget? What do I need to break through this situation? Just one thing. That's all I need. Oh. Go see Emporio. This. This is all I need. Yep, I yep, yep. For one more. Now it's down to these two. These two are the only ones I need. I can 86 the rest myself. And get back to my goal of breaking the fuck out of here. Oh! I, I spilled my water. This is really bad. And meet Jolene like I'm supposed to. I have something important to tell Jolene. I gotta go. She needs me. No matter what happens, I can't forget that. I have to get out of this room. Oh my God! He's on. He's in the same boat. He has, he has the notes to- Oh my god, Emporio, my our boy! I have to pull the plug before I die. I need to pull the plug. I'm being electrocuted. The power is short. Otherwise- Wait a minute. I have to go see Emporio? I remember seeing something like that on Jolene's arm right before I wiped it off. I suppose I'll have to confirm it though. Still, no one's escaping from here. It's an airtight fortress. Does she know who Emporio is? And this theme. So mysterious. Oh, he has the data. Okay, that's going to be the episode. Wow. Wow. This was amazing, guys. This. Mmm. Mmm. This might be my favorite episode of the season just because of it's so unique. It's such a it's so non JoJo, right? Normally stand fights is, you know, very niche, but the the fight here is figuring it out. Like this is 
this is like the psychological shit, which I think we kind of want to see more. It's very underrepresented, right? This is similar to the Marilyn Manson fight, where the fight itself is easy. It's just the conditions surrounding the fight. Like, you need to break through the the wall of figuring out what you need to do, right? Because of, like, the whole three items you can only remember. Similar to that fight, similar to the Dabi fights, right? It's, it's all there. They're all, on paper, very easy um, stand fights. But just breaking the whole, can you fight, though, right? There's just a situation that's preventing you from engaging. Ah, man. And we're getting Emporio, our, our best boy. It's a Jolene and Emporio episode. Wow. I, I hope we get more Emporio next episode. Because it, it's a two-parter, right? I wonder... I wonder why she she didn't put it... Or maybe she placed the clue or the the stand effect in uh, weather reports um, cell as well. The question is, why is she working for Pucci? That is the weird part. We we kind of need to know the backstory there. But yeah, if you guys like the content, like, comment, subscribe. If you want to support your boy even more, links to Patreon down in the description. Put some besos in the comments, guys. Because your boy needs a little... You know what I mean? And I'll see you guys on the next one. Cheers.